Help! It's a realistic time! Look at those bees, dude! Look at the grass! Look at the owl! Okay, maybe don't look at the sun. I even have a body and everything. Look at the water! It's so realistic! My goal is to beat the game as realistic as possible, although I'm already dipping into the yellow on computer temperature, so I'm a little concerned already. Dude, whenever I punch a tree, I take damage. Are you serious? What? Why? I spawned in a tree. Do I at least die realistically? Oh, no! A little crafty! What the heck? Hey! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I think my PC is overheating. Oh, this is not- ah! Oh, no! Oh, the lag! How do I get my temperature down? A realistic wandering trader. Can you help me, man? What do you trade? Realistic act. Realism lost. First person body. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I downgraded my realism, but at least my computer isn't on fire. I'm no longer burning the forest down. I also can chop down trees normally, too. Oh. Right click to sweep attack. Oh, that's nice, dude. Yeah. This is realistic. Using dynamite to break my tree. I still do want to beat the game as realistic as possible, so I'm going to try not to downgrade as much as I can. It's time, my friend. I got the flimsiest looking pickaxe of all time. I feel like I would break this on a piece of spaghetti or something. The first thing I want to do is get myself some armor. Some realistic armor. Nice. Okay. Well, that pickaxe is looking a little better, but not by much, dude. Ooh, we got ourselves a stone sword. These are all looking pretty flimsy, man. Dude, it is so dark and spooky in here. All right. Got ourselves a little bit of coal here. That'll make seeing a little bit. Oh, my. I wish I hadn't seen that. I'm quite split between this being totally terrible. Terrifying and also so awesome. Oh god, baby zombie! I can't kill you, zombie. I don't like this. No thanks, dude. Oh, that Enderman is horrifying. Ah, they can't die from fire either. No, no, no. Okay, chill, dude. There are zombies everywhere. I'm having a great time. Okay, that's better. It's not the best looking house. At least we got something. There's my furnace. I got six iron from my little adventure. I know this looks more like a pork shop than iron, but at least I can make myself a new pickaxe and sword. My goal really is to get armor to survive, but next up is gonna be diamond. And I guess my side quest is seeing if I can, you know, take out zombies. I didn't expect the undead to be unkillable, although it does make sense. Ooh, baby, I like this new sword I got. All right. Can I take you out with this sword? Yeah. Okay, that also doesn't work. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that's horrifying, man. This is gonna be harder than I thought. All right. Nice upgraded pickaxe. Find myself some diamonds now. Oh, man. My computer temperature's going up. Ow! I gotta get out of here. Oh, there's a creeper. God. Or these guys. Can I kill a creeper at least? Oh, I can. Seems that only the undead monsters I can't attack. Can I please get a diamond around here somewhere, dude? Is that a diamond? All right. Got a little bit of gold. Oh, the temperature is getting too high, man. Gosh, I'm setting everything on fire again. No, no, no. Hey, buddy, I need to make a downgrade real quick. My computer is lagging like crazy. I can trade him a realism level for a, a realistic shovel. Hey, realism lost. Looks like our texture pack got a little bit of a downgrade, but honestly, not too bad. And thankfully, our computer temperature is back to normal height. I did get this shovel here. Right click to throw dirt to bury mobs. Oh, this might be how I take out to zombies and undead creatures now. I literally bury them a grave. Sounds realistic. I know in my daily life, I'm just out here burying zombies. Just an average Tuesday. You're a zombie. Okay, hey, buddy. Now, question is, I can just bury you now? How does this work? Oh, oh, okay. Okay, I throw dirt at him. Go, bury. Get buried or something. Oh my gosh, I did it. I buried the zombie. Can I damage him now? Looks like I still can't damage mobs. I might have to get a realistic sword or something, but I can at least put them underground. You can call me the Undertaker. Yeah! That's awesome, man. I'm off to find some diamonds, my boy. So far, that wandering villager was the only way I knew on how to get my computer temperature down. So hopefully we'll be able to figure something else out. Found myself a pretty looking mine, champ. Diamond? Gosh dang it, it's copper. Oh, where are you? Underground, please. Thank you. It's where you belong. All right, Mr. Zombie, you can be above ground for scary movies or whatever. Hey, hey, that looks like a diamond. Come to Papa. Yeah. What? Hello? That's diamonds, right? What? Not good, dude. Does that mean I have to get a realistic pickaxe? Well, my as well get stacked up on this iron while I'm here. I think this is iron. Yeah, this is iron. Well, guys, I made it back to the mine shaft. I figured that'd be the best place to find a realistic pickaxe. Looks like a miner villager is up here. Hey, my friend, you got something for me? Yes, a realistic pickaxe. Looks like we'll lose our shaders, which is a bit annoying, but honestly, that's not so bad. Oh, man, everything looks kind of gross now. Look at how sad these lanterns are. Okay, I'm gonna try to keep it as realistic as I can from now on. Ooh, the realistic pickaxe. Mine's in a three by three. My goodness, dude. Well, it's useful at least, and I'm really hoping I can get those diamonds now. I don't know how realistic the pickaxe is. With one swing of my pickaxe, I take out a wall. But regardless, I'm not complaining, dude. Now, here's the big test. Does this work on diamonds? Come on now. Yeah! 
and we got ourselves some diamonds. I mean, they're not that realistic, but you know what? We take what we can get. Feels like false advertising. Those diamonds looked way cooler than what I got. Oh, shoot. I forgot I don't have a realistic sword yet. Ah! No, 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 no. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Please, please, please. Ah! Go away. Go away. Go away. Thank you. Uh, instead of burying them, I'm just gonna create a giant dirt wall. Okay, sounds good. We got some more diamonds here. If I'm gonna beat the game, I might as well get some diamond armor, shall we? Ooh, diamond. Ooh, diamond. Ooh, diamond. Ooh, diorama. Ooh, diamond. Oh, God. Full diamond, baby. Let's go. Although, I'm a little disappointed. The diamond armor looks so sick, but only my pants show the texture. So, I, I guess I really am losing realism. Ouch. That was a bad idea. Speaking of being on fire, let's head to the nether, my friend. Oh, gosh. Am I gonna die for real? Oh, come on. Now, before we head to the nether, though, I have one side mission I wanna make. The nether is gonna be quite dangerous, and if I'm beating the game, I'm gonna actually have to get, like, you know, ender pearls and blaze rods and stuff, and I don't think I could bury them to get it. Plus, my PC temperature is already too high, so going to the nether is gonna make it even harder. So I'm gonna see if I can find a village. Ideally, like a blacksmith, getting a realistic weapon would be rad with a capital R. Oh, I hate to do it, but I kinda wanna see the death animation. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. <gasps> Whoa. I actually could make some soup out of this. Gosh, this is so ridiculous, man. I like how they break off into pieces. Man, my PC temperature is getting dangerously high. But regardless, I got some soup for my journey. And so I was off running day and night searching for a realistic villager blacksmith that could give me like a realistic weapon or something. And of course, to cool off my PC, which was slowly turning into a hot vat of magma. I did find a village, but it did not have the blacksmith I was looking for. And on top of that, the computer was just starting to overheat. So see you guys. But not too long after, I found just the right village I was looking for. Yes! Weaponsmith! I was not confident in this working, my dude. Straight up, though, your eye patch does look like a bowl. You want to put some mushroom soup in your eyeball? Quickly trade me before I burn your village down. Not a threat. It just happens sometimes an accident. A realistic sword. We lost our animation and block physics, but honestly, that won't be too much of a loss. But we did get a realistic sword, which apparently we can throw now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I was using the wrong sword. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. Look at this bad boy. Yeah. Got a projectile weapon as well as a melee weapon in the same one. Is it true? Oh, back to boring old normal. Man, that did not help my computer temperature much. I'm still sitting pretty toasty right now. Hello, kitten. Aw, you look like a little lion. At least we got what we're looking for. This sword will be so helpful in the nether, man. Hey Realistically, if I had a sword that I would throw to do damage, I would probably accidentally cut my toes off. Speaking of, I think I just accidentally killed a chicken. My bad. Just gonna grab a couple more of these. Ooh, what might we have? Oh, gosh. Villager, stop. You have violated the law. You must trade your realism with us to be free. Goodness gracious. Sorry, boys. I wasn't trying to steal. I just was looking in the chest. My computer temperature is bad anyways. I trade realism for freedom. Well, guess I don't really have a choice here now, do I? Ah. Uh, okay, looks like we lost our texture pack. Uh, we're now back to our normal mode. <laughs> oh, everything's so boring. But at least our computer temperature is back up to normal height. I'm still trying to beat the game as realistic as possible, although I think at this point it's just gonna get worse and worse, which I'm here for it. I like it. Gotta find some lava so we can head to the nether. Wow, I actually made that. Thought I was gonna die. Okay, something weird I just discovered. If you break obsidian, it breaks like glass. I think that's because in real life, obsidian is basically glass and super breaks. But anyways, it's nether. It's the heck? It's nether time, I said. Nether time! Well, all right. Uh, nether portals don't work anymore. It's missing something, but I don't know what it's missing. Maybe it's missing me because we haven't connected in a while. Ooh, I do see a name tag, though. Nitwit Villager? What the heck do you sell? Sorry, Mr. Nitwit Villager, but uh, your parents were very unkind to you. What do you trade, my dude? Uh, hey! Realistic spider! No, thank you. No, thank you. He sells realistic flint and realistic uh. iron ingot. Oh. Guess I need a realistic flint and steel. Well, I basically have to make this trade, huh? Realistic flint acquired. Oh my gosh, I look terrible. Oh, the textures look so bad now, man. I have no eyes. Look at my inventory, dude. Oh no. So much for realism, huh? Dude, and I still have to make another trade. I gotta trade my realistic mob. Okay, well, realistic mobs are gone. Okay, there we go. I crafted my realistic flint and steel. Can I light stuff now? Oh, I see. Okay. Hey, that actually looks great, dude. All right, well, at least we got this. We can light our portal. And 
their computer temperature is so low. Yeah. Skeleton, look at how funny it looks. Come here, buddy. I don't know why, but the lower textures make everything just look so cute. Hi, buddy. <laughs> oh. Come with me, buddy. There we go. Now we got a cute little guy following us. All right, you cute little nether portal. Is this gonna light now? There we go. All right. It's nether time. Better never nether than never. Oh, what the heck? Holy cow. Our realism is back, dude. I, I guess all the stuff that we changed only changed in the overworld. Well, that's good news. Bad news is our computer temperature is rising like hotcakes. Gosh, and I can see my legs again. I don't like this. Ew. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Oh my goodness gracious. This is absurd. I'm gonna go away from whatever the heck that was. I'm out. Oh my gosh. Guys, look at this. Oh man, we've descended into darkness. <laughs> oh, it's gonna take a while. That might be stairs. I think we might have found the fortress, dude. We gotta find a better way to get down, though. Ow! Wait, 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 wait. I forgot to get a gold helmet. Oh gosh, okay. Pardon me? Don't hit me too hard. I might erupt into flames. There, my friends, is the fortress. A lot of bad guys around here. <laughs> no, I don't like this. Realistic sword. Attack! I love how they fall apart like that. Ah! <laughs> this is horrifying. I might die. Please don't die. Oh, okay. Let me eat something, dude. Raw iron. This is raw iron. It looks like a piece of bread. Hello? The blazes look amazing. Ah! All right, all right, all right. I need to make a shield. Yes! Whoa, the gas is terrifying. Hi, buddy. Block his attack. Advance slowly. Yeah! I hit the piglin. Please, please, please get the blaze. Yeah! We got him, dude. Uh, got another blaze. Yeah! Get him! Ah! This is awesome. No, thank you. No, thank you. I regret every decision I've ever made in my life. Yeah. We got a blaze rod. Thank you, buddy. Ow, ow. Wow. Hey, hey, hey. Ah, ah, ah. What the heck is going on? Are you serious? Whenever I pick up... Ah. When I pick up a blaze rod, I start lighting on fire. I guess it is a blaze rod. It's made of flame. How am I supposed to beat the game now, dude? I gotta either find a different way to beat the game or find a different way to get blaze rod. Well, while we're trying to figure out what to do with the blaze rod... Oh, uh, computer temperature has raised. What am I supposed to do now? There's gotta be something I can trade around here. Maybe I can trade a piglin for my realism or something? Well, guys, I found two things. Technically three. I found cute little piglin. I found this shiny thing. Ow, which hurts my toes. And check this out. I found this guy, a leathered armor piglin, which trades something. Realistic fireproof glove. Oh, okay. Actually, that's not bad at all. I'll lose my first person body render, but I don't even need that anyway. Not too bad. I can no longer see my toes. Thanks, buddy boy. Oh, didn't mean to smack you. I was trying to trade you. Oh, you are disgusting, my goodness. We're heading back to the fortress to get our blaze rod. You know, what's the best thing to stack over with? It's gonna be wood. Ow! Bad idea. Okay. <laughs> Am I here? Okay, I'm here. Fiery piglin. Somebody I can trade with. Hold on. Weird looking grandma. All right, I made it, and I did not erupt into flame. Okay, maybe only once. Oh, I don't want to lose my shaders, though, dude. Although the shaders are causing my temperature to overheat. Yeah, all right, fine, dude. I'll trade you, I'll trade you. But I'm not happy about it. Realism lost. Oh, goodbye, shaders. Oh, lava is disgusting. This place used to be beautiful, man. I can trade for more blaze rods. I do lose my ultra HD textures, although that's fine. The nether looks horrendous right now. Sure, man, let's do it. Well, there goes our textures. Ooh, actually, I'm cool with this lava looks much better than before. Why does this look like beans, dude? These look like egg sacks or something. Also, our computer temperature is green, so I'm happy with that. Time to get myself some ender pearls. Like to see what a realistic dragon looks like. Came to the warp forest to find myself some endermen for the pearls and uh, found somebody different. Oh god, the enderman is horrifying. I want to look at him so bad, but I I don't want to know what he looks like. Oh, he looks so. Ah, no! I didn't even look at you. I'm sorry. Oh, you are so much scarier when you're realistic. Ah! No, 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 no. Am I gonna die? Don't kill me. Okay. Sorry. Our axolotl. He looks cute now. There we go. We got ourselves one ender pearl. What are you trading, my man? Ender pearls. Well, that makes sense. I gotta trade animations and block physics. Thanks, buddy. Okay. Well, nothing really seems changed. He still trades more pearls. Oh, man. This means I could be done with my pearl hunt. Oh, I don't want to lose my textures, man. But I feel like I got to, right? All right. I made the trade. My computer's very cool and everything is now not as cool anymore. Cool thing now is this means I'm actually done with the nether. I hope our flint and steel still works. Nether is complete. Oh, I forgot. Textures out in the overworld are much worse. Ah, well, computer temperatures looking good. Let's see what this realistic dragon looks like. All right, guys, I think I found it. Wow. Looks like an 8-bit Mario swallowed paint and vomited. It's gorgeous. All right, let's find this stronghold, shall we? Mining down deep into a cave. This is super realistic. <laughs> I heard a little guy. He went like this. Yeah. 
Yes! We got it, boys! We're here! This looks so cool, man! This looks like a game for kids or something. I think it's just the super cute textures. Dragon, I am here to slay you, and no, not as like Santa's slay. I'm here to kill. Any reasons to be sad? And to turn you into 100,000 little particles, but let's not talk about that. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, baby, it's dragon time. My computer's getting hot, Mr. Axolotl. I might need to use your water a little bit while I'm down there. Let's do this! What? Oh, wait, what? That's the opposite of a realistic dragon. All right, well, dragon, I guess you're going down or something. How am I supposed to get across this, dude? What are these blocks? Ender pearl. I'm gonna throw my square at... <laughs> this is Ender pearl. Go, Ender pearl. Yeah! All right, dragon, it's time for you to die. Hey, yeah! Take my realistic sword! Oh, gosh, sword, please come back. That's not good. That's not good. Oh, it came back. Yeah! Oh! Okay, very painful. Who the heck is that? Explorer villager. Yes, what do you got, dude? He trades me a realistic bow for first-person body render. I don't have one of those, man. I don't got nothing. Everything is squares. Gosh, I guess I gotta do this the old-fashioned way. Okay. Yeah. One down, 700 to go. Uh, yeah. Does my sword work? Yes. Okay, my sword works on the crystals. Hey, yeah. And... That's it! All right, that is all of the- ah, one more. Come on, Axolotl. You got this, dude. Yeah, nailed it. Boom! Let's do this, dragon! Now it's time for some good old-fashioned booty smacking. Yeah, here, here. Ah, feels like good old times. Come here, big old Pepto-Bismol! Come on! Yeah! We've done it, dude! And now it's time for you to get realistic. I mean, come on. Would you really have watched this far if you weren't gonna subscribe? Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next episode.